Hello friends, Constance here from Cosmopolitan Cornbread. So I've been working on something here today, but I will share about this in another video. What I wanted to share with you today is a really easy instant pot recipe that I filmed, um, I think it was like last week or something like that. This is a recipe that's been on my website for quite a while, but I've never shared a video of it. And so the day I was making this, I just set up the camera and I just filmed the process. And so today I'm just gonna walk you through that recipe. So this recipe is for an easy cheesy potato soup. And this recipe is made in the Instant Pot. So it's a one pot meal. So the first thing I do is I cut up a pound of smoked sausage and I of course use a beef sausage you can use whatever kind of smoked sausage that you like I cut it up into bite-sized pieces press the saute button in your instant pot let it start heating up and then toss in that sausage and cook it until it is nicely browned once it's browned, use a slotted spoon to scoop it out into a dish and then toss in a diced onion And you'll let that cook in the Instant Pot, again on the saute setting until it is tender. I'm gonna peel and cube about two and a half pounds of russet potatoes. When the onion is done cooking, I'll toss the potatoes into the Instant Pot along with three cups of chicken or beef broth, a teaspoon of parsley, half a teaspoon of freshly ground black pepper, half a teaspoon of sea salt, and a cup of half and half. Stir that all together and then I'm gonna press the soup button on the Instant Pot. and I'm gonna let it run a 30 minute cycle. When it's finished, I just take an immersion blender and I give the soup a couple pulses. And what that does is it purees some of the potatoes and just naturally thickens up the soup without having to add any flour or cornstarch or anything like that. You don't wanna puree everything, just a little bit, just enough to give the broth some body. I add in a cup and a half of shredded sharp cheddar cheese and I add the sausage back into the Instant Pot and I just let everything heat up and the cheese melt all into the soup. And then just serve it with a little bit of extra shredded cheese on top. That is it. Like I said, it is super, super easy. You know, when I was a kid, I really didn't like potatoes. And I remember that my grandmother had a famous potato soup recipe and I never tried it because I didn't like potatoes and I didn't want to try my grandma's potato soup. And here I am as an adult and nowadays I love potato soups, all sorts of potato soups. And I'm kind of sad that I never tried my grandma's potato soup. If any of my relatives do have my grandma's uh, potato soup recipe, I would be interested in trying it. But that said, I do have several potato soup recipes on my website. I will put a link down below to where you can find them if you are interested. And you can also, of course, get a printable version of this recipe that you saw in the video on my website, and you will find that linked down below as well. So that is all I have to share with you today. You will find out about all of this in another video. Thanks for joining me here again at the homestead. My name is Constance from Cosmopolitan Cornbread, and I'll talk to y'all next time.